Hello, welcome back. So, excited ako sa topic na to kasi sa wakas, isi-set up na natin yung WordPress website natin. So, actually, sobrang dali. Napakadaling i-set up ng WordPress website natin. So, let's uh, balikan lang natin kung saan where we left off on our previous lesson. Okay, so on our previous lesson, na-set up na natin yung hosting natin and yung domain natin. So, successfully, na-connect na natin ang uh, callskitesting.ga sa um, sa host natin. So, domain and host connected. What we are going to do now is ilalagay na natin yung data files natin. So, in this case, ang files na ilalagay natin o isa-set up natin is ang WordPress uh, site. WordPress na content management system. Okay, so to do that, let's just click the manage button. Okay, after, after that, um, ito yung the best sa Infinity Free kasi meron na silang, um, uh, bukod na sa free yung hosting, free pa yung website, ay yung, ano, yung control panel. Okay, just click control panel. So, okay, just wait a minute. Okay. So, we are here na sa control panel and uh, the best ang control panel na kasi ang daming functionalities. And one of the functionalities ng control panel is um, one-click install ng WordPress website. Okay. So, punta tayo sa baba lang tayo. Punta din. Punta lang tayo sa software and then sa software, just click soft uh, soft softaculous. Softaculous App Installer. Okay, click. So, once we have clicked yung App Installer na to, just click again yung WordPress kasi ito yung gusto natin i-install. Alright, so andito na tayo. So, sa directory, sa software setup, okay na yan. Yung protocol na yung domain, okay na rin. Yung directory na lang, tanggalin natin yung WP. And then, dito na tayo magde-decide ano bang, ano bang magandang pangalan ng website. Um, Kolski Testing, ang baduy eh. Pero sige lang, pang-testing lang din naman eh. Kolski Testing, okay. This is just a testing website. Parang yun yung definition or site description mo. And then, sabihin natin admin username. Ang admin username natin, na yun. Uh, sige, admin na lang yung username and then yung password, pass pa rin. Okay na yan. Okay, so, ang uh, admin email natin is admin at callskitesting.ga. Okay lang yan, walang problema dyan. And then, baba tayo, baba tayo sa themes, wag na muna yan. Okay na yan. And then, punta tayo sa install. Alright, email installation details to gusto ko i-email natin yung ano yung installation details sa email address natin so kolski test at gmail.com okay so what what this does is lahat ng uh, details tulad ng password um, admin link um, and most of the necessary details is i-email niya sa atin sa email address ato and then, once na-setup mo na lahat, just click install. And then, just wait for the magic to happen. Okay? And, yun. Ganun kabilis. Tapos na. Na-install na ang um, WordPress natin. So, okay. Ito yun. The, the, the final moment. Ano kaya ang itsura na ng website natin? So, puntahan. Let's visit our website. I-click lang natin tong Ito, yung link na to, di ba? WordPress has been successfully installed at Kolski Testing J. So, click natin tong link. Alright. Let's just wait for our website to respond. Ayun. Bingo. So, we have now a new website. O, di ba? Ang galing. Libre lang lahat yan. Yung hosting, pati yung ano, yung domain name. So, ito yung may website na tayo kasi nga lang unconfigured pa. Okay. So, what we are going to do next is pupunta tayo sa admin panel na to. So, ang admin panel is basically, doon mo nakokontrol lahat. Parang ito yung back-end. Ang front-end, doon mo makikita yung ano yung 
uh, nasa ano ng website, parang parang sa tindahan niya na, 'di ba? Yung nasa harap, yun na yung pinapakita mo, yung mga parinda mo, pero yung nasa likod, andun yung ano mo, siguro andun yung um doon mo kino-control yung mga bookkeeping mo or ano bang mas magandang illustration. So, parang ganun yung concept. Nasa labas yung pinapakita mo, and then nasa loob, doon yung controls mo. So, ito yung nasa labas, and yung sa loob naman is i-access natin through this link. Ito, administrative URL. So, yung administrative URL, just click this link, and we will be redirected to the dashboard. Okay, so welcome to the WordPress dashboard. Okay. So, as you can see, punta tayo sa mailbox natin. So, in case makalimutan mo yung mga links, isasend naman yun sa, ano mo, sa email mo. In-email na ni Saptaculous app yung mga necessary details. So, andito na yung URL ng website natin, yung admin URL, yung username, and then yung password. So, andyan na lahat. Yung SQL database, database username, host, yung password, lahat. Lahat andyan na. Okay? So, uh, that's just it for this lesson. And then, on the next lessons, we will be discussing yung specific how to operate the WordPress website. Okay? So, stay tuned on this very exciting series. Alright?